You proposed that securing our borders will help the situation. How do you suggest that we make it easier for people who want to get in this country legally to do that? So there's this idea that we have to make it easier to get into the country. I probably agree with that. So I think that we should have a moratorium on immigration right now. I think we've got to slow down. We have way too many people coming into America. We've got to throttle back and digest the meal. We've got to allow assimilation to happen. We, got to allow, we have way too many people coming into America. Now, that's not saying legal immigration shouldn't go up again. I think it could be a phenomenal asset to America, and it has been a phenomenal asset. But many times in American history, specifically the 1950s and early 1960s, we ratcheted back to almost zero immigration into America. The reason is post-World War II, of course, you know, there was a lot of damage in other places, but the, there was plenty of people that wanted to come to America in the 1950s, a ton. Think about it. Europe is destroyed. But they said, we have a moral obligation to World War II veterans to make sure they have good wages, good jobs, and we're going to deliver for them. That was a moral argument. Right? And so legal immigration should always be viewed through the prism. Does it benefit the country and the citizens that are already here? Currently, our legal immigration system is so messed up that we prioritize the people that don't share Western values, and we don't bring the people that could potentially share Western values. Right now, we have to slow down, throttle it back. We're doing things way too quickly. Our green card system has a million people coming in every single year. So I think that we need to have an English test to come into America. I think that there should be that certain countries should be prioritized other, over other countries. I think certain countries share Western values, um, and we should be unafraid to say that. It's a thought crime. I don't care. I want people that fit into the American experiment, fit into the story. And that's not a racial thing, by the way, at all, whatsoever. I believe that Cubans can make some of the, have and will make and do make the greatest Americans in America. It's not a racial thing. Instead, so you look at it and say, wow, is this actually making America more free and fulfilling our obligation to our fellow countrymen? What I just said, I get attacked wildly for. I don't care. It's true, and someone needs to say it. And opening your borders, say anyone can come for any reason whatsoever, regardless if they speak the language, regardless if they agree with Western values, regardless of their belief in the Constitution, is wrong. And it's, it's destroying the country from within. Guess what? Our generosity has been taken advantage over the last 20 years. It's time we put our citizens first.